بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم مائی نیم از محمد عاصم ایم ورکنگ ایز ڈیو آپس انجینئر ٹوڈے آئی ایم گوئنگ ٹو شو یو ہاؤ یو کین سیٹ اپ وارڈ ہشکاپ وارڈ ان اے کوئک وے اینڈ آئی ایم گوئنگ ٹو شو یو دا ہینڈس آن لیبس سو یو ول بی ایبل ٹو انڈرسٹینڈ ہاؤ وارڈ ورکس اینڈ ٹو بی ریئلی آنسٹ اف یو واچ مائی وارڈ ویڈیوز یو ول بی اسٹارٹ ڈپلوئنگ وارڈ ان یور uh dev production or local environment so uh, i'm going to show you first how you can set up vault and i will definitely show you um, in this video how you can set up a uh, vault in your local environment by simply running my bash script so uh what i'm gonna do uh i'm gonna launch my ec2 machine let it start and what i'm gonna do uh, i'm gonna launch ec2 instance uh, I, i'm going to show you uh, in this video how you can quickly set up vault and later on and next videos i'm going to show you um, how we can use vault in your uh, in our environment so uh, in this video we are going to deploy vault uh, shiko vault uh in the ubuntu uh, machine on aws and as well as the amazon linux machine so uh, i'm going to select d3 medium for this demo select next name um uh, amazon linux call this vault so guys uh, as far as the um, highly available production ready environment i've already made a video with regard to that you can watch that particular video so you will be able to know how you can set up highly available uh, cluster with https enable on that particular cluster so i'm going to select my ip and I'm going to allow custom TC, uh, TCP port 8200. So, okay, let it allow it from my IP as well. And I'm going to create key pair vault. So, here you go. I'm going to download this key pair. I'm going to paste it on my desktop. Okay. So now I'm going to show you guys let it run. I'm also going to show you uh how you can set up uh, vault on your local environment and the same script is going to be run and it is going to be work on Amazon Linux uh, as well as on your ubuntu local machine or centos or um, amazon linux so uh, what I, i guess i have not tried on centos but um, as far as the amazon linux is concerned you know commands are uh, pretty much same so uh, what i'm going to do uh, i'm going to become sudo and navigate to desktop navigate to desktop okay so i'm gonna remove everything which is already created so just want to show you that uh, everything is crystal uh, clean and clear so remind me later okay so uh, this is the script i've created for you guys Uh, for the quick uh, vault setup, uh, you're going to set up this vault in just, uh, I guess, in one minute. So, uh, it will, in fact, set up uh, the Docker as well. So, uh, this vault setup is going to use the Docker environment. So, I'm going to call this vault.shell. I'm going to uh, insert it. paste it 
okay so everything is going to be set up for you guys simply make it executable like this way i'm doing it for you guys so just run it so this is running on my uh local machine i'm going to show you and also we are going to ssh into this particular machine but before that um, i wanna allow all traffic from inside my um, this security group and the reason for that i will uh, tell you later as is the demo um, this is the demo so you can uh, narrow it down according to your environment so okay this part is also done and it is fine i'm going to ssh into this particular machine so simply take another shell i'm going to zoom in a bit so cd into desktop and ssh hyphen i vault dot pen and machine is uh, amazon linux ec2 dash user is the default so simply navigate to this machine okay I'm logged in okay yes uh, your yeah, internet is there it is no issue with that okay what I'm gonna do simply also call this wall dot shell um, I'm going to insert it in the same script simply copy it and paste it and that's it ch mode plus x wall dot shell and run it so guys uh, this is not a uh, dev uh, involvement of vault uh, the reason i'm saying it man uh, it is a production uh, environment but the back end i'm not going to show you uh, to set up like as a, uh, as i've already made video uh, video with regard to that uh, in which i have set up the um, dyno dynamo db as a backend so this world is uh, set up so um, this is not uh, a dev one so i'm going to show you uh, what i'm going to do simply copy the public ip address of this put it here paste it here okay and the default uh, port for port is 8200 okay the display uh, gonna show in front of you that is uh, status is uh, uh, i mean locked or unsealed so i'm going um, to uh, unseal it so the key uh, share is going to be five and and key threshold which means if three keys are provided it is going to unseal it so i'm going to download these keys on my desktop the same stuff you can do from your uh, uh, command line as well but i guess uh, it is a lot quicker from the um, and go into this so i'm going to unseal it simply uh, provide this uh, provide these keys you have to provide these uh, three keys to unseal it okay and other one So guys, uh, your wall is ready. I'm going to simply provide the root token. So you will be able to access it. So this is your vault ready. Uh, this is the same production ready environment. So uh, it is not running in a dev mode. So 
you have to do same stuff when you run uh, vault uh, in your production environment you see status is unsealed everything is cleared now i'm going to show you the local environment same script is going to be work in the local environment as well and let me show you the ip as well ip version for this of my uh, machine which is uh, this one so i'm going to simply use this and paste it here and also put the relevant port so same stuff we have to do uh, which i've already shown you at this time i'm not going to show you so just i want to show that you see this is running locally and this is running on the public ip address of uh, our uh, aws uh, amazon linux ec2 instance so uh, guys um, that's it in this video uh, in my later video i'm going to show you uh, the hands-on how you can use this vault in your dev production or uh, even you create local environment you will be able to access it and also uh, use your application uh, through this vault and we are going to set up the dynamic credentials so if you like this video, please like, share and subscribe my channel and press the bell icon. See you uh, in my next video. Thank you. Have a nice day.